What's good with the YouTube? It is your boy Vaughn, and as you guys can see by the title, we are back with a new video for you guys today, and we're gonna be reacting to SML movie Jeffy's Rubik's Cube. Now I'm still kind of catching up on these, and I know that they drop them periodically throughout the week. So we're gonna continue dropping SML reactions for you guys because I know you guys really want these and really enjoy these. And uh yeah, as always, the original video will be in the description down below while you guys are down there. If you would like to follow my social medias, I would greatly appreciate it. And without further ado, we're gonna go ahead and dive right into this. Let's get it. Jeffy, is that a Rubik's Cube? Nope, clearly not. Jeffy, if you're trying to solve it, <laughs> those things are impossible. They're only for smart people. Well, then I guess I am smart people. What, Jeffy, you actually solved it? <laughs> hey, yo, he did that in like one second. That well, was Daddy, smooth. I may be slow, but I solved this hoe. And since I solved this Rubik, I'm going to smack this pubic. What? Okay, Jeffy, hey, yo, yo Jeffy, so pause, pause. Sure, mommy. No, oh, Jeffy, seriously, how'd you solve that? Dang, it's easy. All you gotta do is match the colors together. Okay, Jeffy, here you go. All right, watch me work. It doesn't even look like he's solving it. It looks like he's messing it up. Dunion rings. But oh, you <laughs> solved it again. It only took like 10 <laughs> Dunion seconds. Dunion rings? 10 seconds? That's not even my fastest time. <laughs> Hold on, bro. I, I got my own lingo, but I'm starting to peep some of the stuff that Jeffy's saying. He, got, he really got his own slang. I'll fuck with that. Okay, Jeffy. Oh, four seconds. Four seconds, Jeffy? That's amazing. You could set a world record. Yeah, I am pretty smart. <gasps> Daddy, there's cheese in my ear. What type of cheese? <laughs> you think it is? Be a sharp cheddar. Ew. Oh, Jeffy, hey, hey yo. No cheese, that's earwax. Sharp What's the cheddar last is time the you best cheese. Your ears, though? Jeffy. You're supposed to clean your ears. I thought your ears were for hearing. <sighs> Baby, go get him a Q-tip. Okay. All right, <laughs> Jeffy. These are Q-tips. I hate Q-tips. What do I do with these? You put it in your ear. In my ear? Mm. Yeah, like that. Now you move it around. <laughs> Oh, that feels good. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Jeffy, yeah. be careful. You're going to hurt your ears. Yeah, Jeff. I'm not going to lie. When it comes to me and Q-tips, actually, like when it comes to like my ears, I do produce a lot of earwax. Sometimes I literally have earwax just fall out of my ear randomly in the middle of the day. I don't know how I produce so much, but I do. And then when it comes to Q-tips, I'm so like sensitive. I don't like Q-tips in my ear because I don't want them. I, I feel like if you go too far, that shit is going to hurt, bro. I don't want to experience that pain. Yeah, so I don't, Jeff, I don't, don't like push it too far, you might hurt your ear. <laughs> Dang, look! Dang, oh, Jeffy! Jeffy! No, Jeffy, you're not supposed okay. to do that. Dang, that was so good. It was blue cheese. Package it up. Jeffy, that's not cheese. That's earwax. <laughs> you're not supposed to eat that. But, Danny, I have an unlimited supply of cheese in my ear. It's cheese for the whole world. Jeffy, it's not cheese for the whole world. It's earwax. Everyone has that in their ear. I know his. Yeah, I know Jeffy's ear ringing spoil. right now. Jeffy? Oh. Marvin, I'm going to get him a glass of water if he's going to keep eating his earwax. He needs to stop eating his earwax. It can't be healthy. Well, eventually it'll run out, right? We can hope. All right, Daddy. I got a factory in overdrive. Everyone's about to have cheese for days. <laughs> okay. All right, Jeffy. I brought you a water. Mommy, check out my cheese sticks. I even made a cheese pyramid. Ew! <laughs> Jeffy, get all the earwax off the couch. Hold on, Daddy. I got one more good one. And I got to get really good. That boy, <laughs> that boy Jeffy, do. really Marvin, talented, though. Not out of earwax yet. He I might be no slow or whatever, but he looked. Oh! Jeffy, his brain! Oh, Jeffy, it looks like a piece of your brain. <laughs> <laughs> this is my fear right here. This is literally my fear, y'all. My brain? Oh my god, Marvin, we have to call a doctor! Okay, I'm gonna call a doctor. Hey, Leah, somebody call a doctor? Ooh, cheese sticks! Oh my gosh, <laughs> Brooklyn guy, <laughs> chill. Oh god, that's just earwax on a Q-tip. Why didn't anybody tell me? Because I thought you were smart since you're a doctor. Not all doctors are smart, okay? I cheated to get where I am. Like, there was this fat bitch in front of me in college named Abby. I just copied off her. She's a much more successful doctor than I am. Yet fat, so I'm winning. Anyway, what do you guys need? <laughs> so Jeffy was playing with a Q-tip, and he dug out a piece of his brain. Okay, look, that's impossible. Okay, he'd have to break through his eardrum, which would be extremely painful. Right, and that part. Skull, and then once it got through to his inner ear, it would cause extreme pain, dizziness, and, and vomiting, bleeding. Okay, there's no way that would be an accident. That's what I'm saying. Like, well, he was doing it on purpose. He was trying to shove it as deep as he could in his ear. <sighs> okay, let me go get my autoscope. All right, let me take a look in there. Oh, yeah, there's a big chunk of his brain missing. Wait, so that is his brain? Yeah, that's his brain on the Q-tip there. Is he gonna die? I don't know. How you feel, Jeffy? <laughs> <laughs> is that normal? Yeah, he normally acts like that. Oh, well, look, he'll be just fine then. Look, the brain is so big, you don't need all of it. That little piece on the Q-tip, <laughs> that's probably like one memory. He'll be okay. So you think it's just one memory? Oh, yeah, he'll be fine. Yeah! 
Is that a Rubik's Cube? Yeah, Jeffy can solve a Rubik's Cube in four seconds. Whoa, that's got to be a world record. You should enter him into the National Annual Rubik's Cube Solvatron competition. What's that? Well, Watch him not know how to solve it now because that was his Rubik's Cube backpacks. part of his Get brain. Get together to see who can solve a Rubik's Cube the fastest. I mean, no females are allowed within 500 miles of the competition, but first place gets a $25 gift card to QE Tuesdays and a million dollars. Look at Jeffy's ear in the background. <laughs> A Rubik's Cube? Yeah, I mean, they're mostly just doing it for the gift card because a million dollars is still not enough to get them laid. They're just going to spend the money to buy more Rubik's Cubes, but yeah. I can't <laughs> believe, Jeffy, you can make a million dollars just to solve this. Well, I mean, second place, you still get $500,000, and third place gets 100000 but fourth place gets you executed by firing squad. They kill you? Yeah. yeah I mean, you can still come in fifth place. You get 10000 for that. And fourth place, no, they will kill you. They do not tolerate mediocrity. So as long as Jeff oh, gets we. first, second, third, or fifth, he gets money? Yeah, yeah, just don't come in fourth. That would be bad. Oh, my God. Jeffy's going to totally win that competition because he can solve a Rubik's Cube in four seconds. So, so when is it? Uh, it's in two hours, but it's 500 miles away. Marvin, we'd have to travel 250 miles per hour to get there in time. Our car doesn't go that fast. Okay, I'll let you guys borrow my rock. It ship. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Ain't no to way. the annual National Rubik's Cube Solvatron competition. That transition we was have crazy. I ain't gonna lie. In the world here, protecting their virginities by trying to solve Rubik's cubes as fast as they can. The competition will begin shortly. Hmm. I'll get it. Hello? Trick or treat. We're here for the Rubik's Cube competition. Is that a girl? Yeah. Tell her to get the hell out of here. What? Why? Because none of these boys in here have ever seen a girl before, and if they do, they might cream their bridges. Baby, just go wait in the rocket ship. Aww. Can we come in now? What's the password? Oh, Rubik's Cube dick. Come on in. <laughs> what? Are you ready to beat these kids? <laughs> wow, yeah, Cody's the there. All these kids. Which kid you want me to hit first? No, not beat them up. I meant beat them in solving a Rubik's Cube. What's up, fresh meat? Haven't seen you around here before. So, what's your best time? Best time? Yeah, your best time is solving a Rubik's Cube, idiot. Oh, well, I don't solve Rubik's Cubes, but Jeffy's best time is four seconds. Four seconds? He might win first place this year. Really? Yeah, you see that kid down there? His name is Jackie Two. He <laughs> wins first place almost every year. He's a super agent. And then, beside him, that's Dontavious Rex. <laughs> he has a 12-inch <laughs> wiener. I saw it in the shower one day after... <laughs> <laughs> Practice. You have showers here? Oh, yeah. This competition gets super intense. And then beside him, that's Cody. He's gay. It's true. Well, he's gay. Well, you don't have to worry about me. I go for last place every year. Easiest 10 grand of my life. Oh, but my buddy last year, Fred, he died by firing squad because he got fourth place. And then the year before that, my other buddy, he got banned for life. How'd he get banned? Because he, he brought a girl. Someone say girl. Shut up, Dontavious. Keep your weight on your pants. Damn. <laughs> He's a guy. What are girls not allowed? Girls aren't allowed because the last time a girl was here, everyone's pants got filled with cream cheese. So, oh my why gosh. You two? Oh, I just don't know how. Ha! You hear that, everyone? This guy doesn't know how to cube. <laughs> what a fucking loser. <laughs> <laughs> chill, Cody, chill. All right, everyone, we're ready to start the competition. So here's how this is going to work. Everyone's gonna come up, and we're gonna time how fast you can finish a Rubik's Cube. The person with the fastest time wins a million dollars and a $25 gift card to QB Tuesdays. The person who comes in fourth place gets... How are you gonna win a million dollars and then a $25 gift card? What's the point of the $25 gift card when you just won a million? All right. <laughs> now, first up is our newcomer, Jeffy. Okay, Jeffy, I'll start the timer by hitting the space bar, and when you're done with the Rubik's Cube, I'll stop the timer by hitting the space bar again. And I'll let you know what your time was. The world record is 3.13 seconds. On your mark, get set, go! What am I supposed to do with this? Well, you didn't get the record, but keep going. Jeffy, hurry up and solve it. I don't know what this is. I've never seen one of these before in my life. Jeffy, don't screw with me. You solved it earlier. I did? Yes, Jeffy, solve it! I don't even know what this is. <laughs> oh my god. Do you think that part of your brain you pulled out was the part that made you solve a Rubik's Cube? It has to be because I've never seen one of these before in my life. Yeah, uh, I know Mr. it. I he know it. How to solve a Rubik's Cube. But what? Yeah, he, I thought he did, but he doesn't know how to do it anymore. Well, then why the hell would you come to a Rubik's Cube competition? I don't know. Well, I guess I'll have to give you fifth place. Here's $10,000. <laughs> Just like that? Yeah, sure. 
<laughs> bro, imagine being in a competition and it's like that, bro. Okay. Come on, Jeff, let's go. And up next, we have Cody Nutkiss. On your mark, get set, go. Cody yeah, Nutkiss is crazy. Come on, Cody. Wow, what a snows fast. Done. Wow, 6.9 seconds. <laughs> 69. And up next, we have <laughs> Dontavious Rex. On your mark, get set. Go! Shit! Shit! Oh! Shit. That's gonna cost him some time! Come on, kid, hurry up! Done! Not my best time! Mother will not be pleased. Are, are you gonna finish it? Just one second. Okay, I think that's good enough to get a nice smooth fifth place. Well, congratulations, you came in four. What? Time to die! I know it, I know it! I know it! I knew he was gonna be the one that got fourth place, bro. <laughs> And last, we have the defending champion, Jackie, <laughs> Jackie Two. <Choo. laughs> On your mark, get set, go! Done! Everybody can suck my wiener! Oh, <laughs> my <laughs> oh, the world Bro, hold on! Suck my uh, oh, get set, go! Done! Everybody can suck my wiener! <laughs> holy holy, he broke the world record! <laughs> Literally. First place! Oh, I'm so full. Maybe just one more. Brooklyn hey, guy going crazy. how was the competition? <laughs> uh, no, before you ask, I did not eat the earwax off of these Q-tips. That would be disgusting. Little do they know I did. I am one sick son of a bitch. I even ate the earwax pyramid. <laughs> and I kept some in my pocket as a little snack for later. <laughs> I wonder how many carbs there are in earwax. Brooklyn guy is so the weirdest the motherfucker on, this, oh, on the show, literally. We fifth place, so we got $10,000. Oh, nice. I feel bad for the guy who came in fourth, though. Yeah, so you know that piece of brain that Jeffy pulled out? Well, that part of his brain was the part of his brain that knew how to solve a Rubik's Cube. Oh, that sucks. Well, how'd you like my rocket ship? It was cozy. It was very fast. Well, yeah, it's a rocket ship. And uh, the mm. fuel for that bitch is pretty expensive. As a matter of fact, <coughs> I, I can only imagine. Shit, a rocket ship, my nigga. Thousand dollars. Oh, looky there, ten grand. What a coincidence. But no, I don't have to pay for your gas. Hey, I gave you my rocket ship. I got to pay for the gas somehow. Don't be a douche. Oh my God, how do you feel, Jeffy? That all that was for nothing. Well, Danny, if you want to make money, I got a cheese. Marvin is soft as hell. Ain't no way a nigga finna walk away with this ten k like that. You just got no. Factory no. in my ear and a chocolate factory in my ass. Hey, oh my uh, gosh, all right, this needs to end. Anybody see him? Like, like, was he at the Rubik's Cube competition? Because he's usually there. Well, he said he always got fifth place, and this year we got fifth place, so... Uh -oh. <laughs> For Jeffy to pull that piece of his brain out, and that was the part of his brain that let him solve a Rubik's Cube in four seconds, I'm not gonna lie, that might be the smartest part of Jeffy's brain that he just took out. Literally. The smartest part. Hey, hey, at least he won 10 grand, but it was for nothing at the end of the day because Marvin is a simp. As always, the original video will be in the description down below. And while you guys are down there, if you would like to follow my social medias, I will greatly, greatly appreciate it. And that does it for this one. I will see you guys in the next one. We are out. Peace.